We saw a great need for forensic science education and services in uh, the western part of Virginia. The Radford University Forensic Science Institute is a professional state-of-the-art forensic science research center and working laboratory associated with the Center for Sciences at Radford University. It also has an academic component and it's associated with the Department of Anthropological Sciences offering a forensic anthropology concentration and a forensic science minor that's interdisciplinary across campus. The main advantage of attending Radford University and participating in the forensic science program is the opportunity to engage in research as an undergraduate student in, in, and often very early on in your career. So you can spend two, three years getting real world experience that can be directly applicable to work post-graduation. Capitalizing on the undergraduate research experience that our students get here at the Radford University Forensic Science Institute, they've gone off to careers at the medical examiner's office or to graduate programs across the country. Forensic science is a very competitive field, often requiring graduate uh, study, and that preparation for that needs to come earlier. Um, the Radford University Forensic Science Institute is uh, very unique and has its strengths in that it's preparing our undergraduates uh, with hands-on engagement in research at an early a time in their life um, and engaging them in one-on-one -on -one study with faculty uh, to prepare them for that career. Many go on to present papers at professional meetings, even as undergraduates. The Radford University Forensic Science Institution has prepared me for my future career as well as grad school in forensic anthropology. I work as an intern for Dr. Boyd in this lab in which I help her with forensic casework and day-to-day -day operations of the lab, as well as research with skeletal trauma, blunt force trauma, and then I'm doing a decomp study in Peru, and all of that has prepared me for my future research goals. The training that I've received at RUFSI includes um, fragmentary osteological remains and identifying that in a casework setting, as well as dealing with medical legal like, terminology and how the day-to-day -day operations of the lab versus going to the medical examiner's office works and how I can apply that to the field. The Radford University Forensic Science Institute has worked hard to develop many partnerships uh, within the uh, Commonwealth of Virginia in terms of law enforcement agencies, medical legal agencies like the Virginia Office of the Chief Medical Examiner. These students here are involved in research from the beginning and therefore they have better skill sets to support law enforcement and others in their endeavors for investigation in a more sophisticated and professional manner. So partnerships that are important to the program here at the Institute are, are numerous. I myself am in this essence a partnership to this university and this program. My experience at the FBI puts me in a very good position to help train students. So partnerships are bringing in new technologies such as I have, um, working with other agencies such as the Chief Medical Examiner's Office, working with law enforcement, working with biotechnology companies that can bring in technologies that we can make use of to train new students or to um, train professionals so that they can develop their skills better. The RUFSI has impacted the Commonwealth through um, investigation and consultation on 180 uh, cases, as well as providing training to students and law enforcement that have improved all of our death investigations throughout the state. RUFSI allows us to have the quality forensic science consulting that larger cities have. So the program is structured to impact the Commonwealth of Virginia in that Dr. Boyd is the forensic anthropology and archaeology consultant for the Western District Office of the Chief Medical Examiner. The program also coordinates with law enforcement throughout all of our counties in Southwest Virginia. Radford University offers the only undergraduate forensic anthropology uh, educational program in the Commonwealth. I work with the Forensic Science Institute 
Using ground penetrating radar and other geophysical methods to be able to find potential barriers. This kind of research is really important for the development and teaching of students in that they get experience with this equipment that they would not get at a major Research One institution. They get experience using very expensive, very good, very delicate, but very useful equipment. And the career paths are many. Some do go into forensics, but as a physics professor, I see people that go into so many other fields. Our students get to get their hands on this equipment. Our students get to use this equipment. Our students get to learn how to use it before they go off and they put out their job application. They can put that right on their application. I have used this thing here. I understand how this is working and you don't have to train me. I can start on day one using this equipment in the company or in whatever you want me to do. In terms of our future outlook, I see the Radford University Forensic Science Institute as incorporating more of an interdisciplinary and multidisciplinary um, perspective and collaboration with others outside our field. I see more focus on the broader issues with mortality and patterns of death in forensic anthropology and trying to understand mortality inequities and the factors that are responsible for them from a more humanitarian perspective.